a group of Christian fathers and scholars brought the New Testament together at, at, at a particular point uh, in history. And they began the structure by putting these four accounts of the life of Christ, okay. which are really remarkable, right? Because if you think about the rest of scriptures, we don't have uh, four accounts of any other sort of thing, mm -hmm. <laughs> right? I mean, it's, 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 and it's, it's really interesting. And so the first three of those, are, we call the synoptic gospels, gospels because they correspond much more closely to each other. Mm -hmm. And then we have the gospel of John. And, and so the first part of the structure is the life of Christ, right? And then we're going to move on from the life of Christ into the book of Acts, which is going to continue a historical narrative uh, through the, the lives of the apostles. And then there's kind of a break. We're going to move from books that have a historical narrative structure to letters. Okay. There's 14 of them. And then we have the book of Revelation, which is sort of a, a, a thing unto itself. Right. The, the New okay. Testament's not very linear, right? We have the life of Christ, the life of Christ, the life of Christ, the life of Christ, and a little bit more history, and then kind of epistles scattered throughout that aren't mm -hmm. clearly in a chronological mm -hmm. order, right? That, that, that we're going to have to do a little bit of digging into, okay, how they fit into the story. Okay. I think even for the Gospels, keeping in mind who the uh, attributed authors have as their intended audience and, yeah. and what their themes are. And, and Matthew's writing to a different, very different group than mm -hmm. Mark is or than Luke is yeah. or than John is. And they, they've got different themes in mind and different purposes and they, they may be drawing on each other. None of these are, are really a, the, the, the gospels are not a biography of Jesus. These are testimonies, and I, that, that's what the JST changes yeah. that to, to a couple of these. The testimony of Matthew about Jesus Christ and the testimony of John about Jesus mm. Christ. And, and, uh, and so keeping in mind, these are testimonies, in two cases, apostolic testimonies, and, uh, and their perspectives on who Jesus was with a specific audience in mind and certain goals and themes that they want to address. Okay. Okay.